Althorpe Gallery houses some of Britain's greatest treasures. It has uh, paintings by, by uh, Van Dyck and, um, and it's never been used for exhibition. Um, so I was like absolutely you know, blown away when they we took some of the works down and uh, they had my exhibition over there. And um, I loved having my work you know, beside such great masters. It's been a real thrill actually to have Christian here with his work. You know, I, I, I spoke to him earlier in the year and to know that this whole literary festival was going to have as its backdrop Christian's wonderful canvases. It's been an incredible treat. And seeing the way that his very loyal patrons and clients, that they come here and enjoy them in this setting, it's been fantastic. We had such an amazing response. Um, we were supposed to just, he was supposed to open it on the Friday, which he did, successfully so, with 450 people. Um, and then we were inundated by another thousand people so Lord Spencer very kindly allowed us to have another tour on the Sunday um, whereby he then had another 500 people come and then that wasn't good enough so we had to then do something in our market behind us um, for another 500 people um, and it really was honestly breathtaking. It's been such an incredible privilege to have Christian's work hanging here you know I feel like for all of us, this is, you know, an incredible opportunity to watch an artist in a spiritual journey, and uh, we just can't wait to see where it goes. Over the course of a few months, I traveled extensively through the Far East, visiting many countries in search of the physical manifestation of a spiritual force. I visited tribal communities, spiritual leaders, shaman, gurus, monks, mystics, rituals, temples, and everything else um, related to the subject, but found little evidence of uh, channeling force at work. When I got to Kyoto in Japan, I found calligraphy masters that could scientifically measure how much of their energy force had been channeled through their work. I used the same knowledge and techniques to create this collection. managed to almost now sell out of every single painting in the most amazing gallery um, that the Spencers have, um, which is their Tudor picture gallery. The Cook is successfully sitting now among some of the most famous Van Dykes in the world. So it's an absolutely a huge honour for Christian, a huge honour for us. And I can't thank uh, Lord and Lady Spencer enough. And it's just been the most amazing finale to what has been probably the most successful Christian Hook event ever. I've always had this argument, in a house such as this you have all these beautiful classical paintings I've always maintained that you can have contemporary things and if they're of a high enough quality they will fit in. And that's definitely the case here. You go in the long gallery, there are great masterpieces by Van Dyck and then you have this wonderful collection by Christian Hook. It works very well indeed. It's been an absolute privilege to be invited to exhibit in Northrop. Um, uh, Lord Spencer and Lady Spencer have been uh, fantastic hosts and the experience has been wonderful for me. Mm -hmm.